FBI is joining local police in their search for a serial bank robber. And here's a look at the man. Very covered, but very bold. WISN 12 News' Mike Anderson explains why police want him off the streets. We would consider him armed and dangerous. The FBI says this man, wearing a painter's type mask, but you can still see part of his forehead and right eye under the hooded sweatshirt, is armed and dangerous. The FBI calls him a serial bank robber. Between April 23rd and May 11th, he robbed three banks in Milwaukee and one in South Milwaukee, all of them inside grocery stores. He has not uh, brandished or displayed a weapon. Um, it, however, one has been seen within a coat pocket. So we, knew that we do believe that he is armed, um, and because of that, he is extremely dangerous. Investigators say the suspect hit the TCF bank here inside the Piggly Wiggly store on 54th Street two times. It upset me, you know, but I just can't stop going in there. Dolores Staten says this is where she shops, but these days it seems you're at risk no matter where you go. Because I can go to pick and save any other store and it could happen there. The FBI describes the suspect as a black male, 6'2 to 6'3, thin build, wearing a North Face jacket, and in some of the pictures you see a white substance like paint or something on one of the shoulders. Which makes his jacket fairly unique in that it, it could potentially provide a clue to his identity. Here's another look at the picture. The FBI says it is getting some calls, but none have led to an identity yet. Mike Anderson, WISN 12 News. And the same robber is also a suspect in a similar robbery at Tri-City Bank in South Milwaukee from May 11th. Any information, if you have any, you're asked to call Milwaukee or South Milwaukee Police.